it is Tuesday, August 6th. Welcome back to the vlog. So, uh, no punishment for me today, huh? Yeah, actually vlogging on a Tuesday. Uh, I have to say that after Sunday's vlog, I really love that the thing you guys focused the most on was the Doctor Who reveal thing when I talked about not ever watching Matt Smith as the Doctor. And I... I love it because it means that you guys are all my people and it was really entertaining to me that, you know, you could have been like, punishing you, yay, woo, I'll start thinking stuff up. But no, it was it was all about the who. Doctor Who, not the who, which is an entirely separate thing. Uh, but that was fantastic. Um, also, before I get to this mess, uh, which I'm going to talk about today, uh, I want to make sure that I talk about a few things that I think you need to know about. Uh, first... It's my friend Kenna's birthday today. Happy birthday, Kenna. Kenna runs geekportland.com, and she is fantastic and wonderful and one of my favorite people. So happy birthday, Kenna. Uh, today is also uh, Stephen Toulouse's birthday. He goes by Steptoe on Twitter. Uh, he is also wonderful and fantastic. I've watched him speak at PAX. I saw him in Wootstock. Uh, I accosted him in the middle of the street last year after PAX to get him to sign the book, uh, and he was really, really nice about that. So happy birthday, Steptoe! Uh, everybody go to Steptoe and wish him a happy birthday on Twitter, because I think he'd get a kick out of it. Uh, Mike Furman has a new song out today. Uh, he's been working on songs that you can sing to your kids, which is slightly different than songs for kids. Although, I suppose, based on the two that he's released so far, kids could sing them too. Uh, so you should go definitely check that out. There will be links in the thing so you can go and listen and buy his song. Uh, what else? Um, Paul and Storm and John Scalzi got into an exchange this morning via Twitter that is probably the best thing that you will read on the internet today. And I think that's it. And now... Uh, I'm gonna talk about my hair. So if you don't really want to talk about my hair or hear me talking about my hair, feel free to go because I've already told you all of the important stuff that I want you to know about uh, and there are links for that. But if you would like to know about my hair, let's talk about my hair because holy crap what a mess. So this is my hair after being washed, conditioned, and air dried for a few hours. Uh, I cut my hair a couple of months ago. I vlogged about that. I will try to find a link for that for you and put that in the thing as well. And maybe, maybe uh, one of those speech bubble things. And um, here's what happened when I went in to cut in my hair. I said, I want to cut off enough to donate to Locks of Love. And then I pulled my ponytail over to the side and went, look, see, I do actually have enough. And then so they cut off the ponytail to give to Locks of Love. And there was still plenty of hair left. Uh, so I said, I don't really care what you do with it, go ahead and have fun, but I just want it to be long enough for me to pull back into a ponytail because it's what I usually wear. This is not the thing to say to a stylist that you don't know, which I should have realized, but you know, I don't get my hair cut all that often and I was... I genuinely did not care that morning. I just wanted it shorter so that I could donate and... She had some fun, my stylist. She was very nice and very chatty and was not really paying too much attention, so my hair is a little bit uneven. Uh, it's also layered, kind of weird, uh, in the back, which I can't see, so really, what do I care? I usually wear my hair pulled back anyway, but yeah, it's a great big hot mess, my hair, and I don't know what to do with it. I did recently switch shampoos because my hair was getting so frizzy that I looked like Jonathan Colton at the end of the concert. Which, you know, I like Jonathan Colton and everything, but uh, his hair is his own, and I, I don't... Yuck. Uh, so, I wanted to know what you guys would do. Don't say shave my head or buzz cut it, because that's not going to happen. Or, if you have some really good styling product recommendations or something to make it better until I can afford to go have it fixed, because icky. No, no, no. Uh, and I'm at four and a half minutes, so I'm going to go, and this was a really disjointed vlog, but I'm not getting punished, so I think it's worth it. And I will be back on Thursday with something else to talk about, hopefully something more coherent. And that's it for today. Thanks for watching, I really, really appreciate it, and I will be back in a couple of days. See you later!